but your winner, Walter Winterbach.
Dias puts up just a little bit. Here comes Fielding on the outside, getting the run loose down back. Dias back down the inside into the three and four. Looking to break off the corner. Almost making contact. Fielding holds on for the win. What a game. Oh, the bottom of the line. Dias with the way to come the green. Up front here comes Morissette back on the outside. Trying to get a run down the back stretch. Trying to throw it high and wide. It's a three and four. They come off the corner. There's the checker flag. Kazuna's down low. Morissette on five. And it's going to be Kazuna's fire here.
Hartford. Out on the inside, Brian Hartling out of Foxborough in the 0 4 event. John Fielding to the outside in the 98 Camaro Fielding. It's a favorite every time he hits the track. But they're dead. Fielding pulls back on that outside lane, really pushing it, maybe too much, he's going to lose the edge, and who's down on the inside, that is Walter Winterbach in the 1988 Trans Am. Up to the outside, Joey Morissette in the 94 Camaro, he's out of Pawtucket, and they are off. Gets the nose underneath there. He tries to make it stick. He does. Off turn number four. Drag race to the finish. Give it a win to They hit the light. They are off. And he's buried to the inside of Cole. Now the back they go. Once the start of the Barry McCall evens it up into three and four. Bunch it through the corner, dead even, across the strike, give it a toll. What a matchup this is, John Johnson and John Johnson. Father and son at the line, they are off. Down to the turn one, the two-time champ a little squirrely off the start. Of the Johnson rolls it high. And across the strike, the two-time champ. With the Corvette to the outside, Kazunas is down on the inside of the Firebird. Inching up to the line, and Kazuna is waiting on the light. They get it. They are off. Dead. Starting down to one. Early. Back the outside, Down to the inside for three and four. He overdrives it just a little bit, opens the door for Hartling as they come across the strike. Dead. Going up against Phil Cambrock. 
Our Dartmouth in the Ford Mustang, Johnson two times. Troy City Tactical Champion. On the outside, they head down at the one, they the Malibu, down into the corner.
inside. Brian Hartman in the Chevy Corvette on the outside. Here's the green nice even start down at the one and two they go. The Corvette up top. Hartley trying to get the one. Camera hanging tight down to the top. Take off and turn number two. Hartley getting his own shot down that trip. Into the three and two they go. Camera back down ball. They come off the corner, but it will be Hartley that takes it down the way. Position to go, they're waiting on the light, they get it. Green is out there on the front. So we're going to get through the corner. Thank <laughs> you. 
the jump. PT nosing him out. The PT. Alton, the PI driving around. Come on. PI on the outside line. Come on. Does he have the power to catch him on the straight? Oh, PT hit the scramble button. Hold on. PI on the outside after a turn four. I can't handle it. That's a good one.
the Corvette catch him on turn three and four. He is nosing out on him, but the oh, man. is right there. He's in the danger zone there. <laughs> All right. Just give it up for Cletus testing out the insurance policy. Here we go, guys. Who's ready to see some good side-by-side -side racing? This is a good start. That inside line does a lot of favors. He's got it. Three seconds. Oh, 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 track trying three. to hold off the ZR1. Can he do it? Oh! Oh my God! Here we go. Flag man is armed and ready. Green flag. Here we go. They're off. because you put on a good show for these folks. And now you've got drapes on the right side of your car. Oh, better start for the ZR1. Neck and neck in the turn one. C8 nosing them out. Small gap on the back straight into turn three. Coming hard on the turn four, C8 still out front. Let's hear it for the C8 Matt from Rear Wheel Drive. Yeah. Now that's how you celebrate a win. Oh, oh, oh. make some noise, boys. Yes. I-8. The Trans Am knock off the I-8 up to the outside as fast he's down to the inside. It's more so they are off. Even the start. The I-8 has that bottom lane. Side by side in the turn number three. Can the Trans Am knock off the BMW off the corner? Stick it to the bottom is more so. Across the line, he will win the I-8. Walter
Another great matchup here, Will Canberra down to the bottom. With his Mustang, Thompson to the outside of the fire Kennedy in that Mercedes. Mercedes and Dotson. That's the line ready to go. They are off and it's Silva. With the advantage down through one and two. That must be one to do though. Kennedy starts to close it into the outside. He starts to lose it though. Take Corral is back. He does, but not enough to take over with Eric Silva. Against the Subaru, or does the Subaru have a shot against the Vega? A crowd by the Vega. Let's see if the speed is as well. They roll through one and two. Down the corner, Joseph Parker. They go down the back of the three Silva. It's Joseph. Battle it out through three and four. Silva on that bottom lane. He has the advantage on turn number four. Kevin Silva wins. 10 BMW, the 2018 Camaro, they are off. We saw a great performance in the first round from Colby. Can he follow it up here, up on that outside lane? Five seconds. Colby down the back, a little bit loose at Adam. I think he scared the Beamer when he went by. That's what it looked like it. Across the stripe run, Colby wins it. Gave the Beamer on the <laughs> They are off, and what a holy crap! A great start for Zion, but I don't think it's a very
Jeff Daniels to the inside of Matt DeRosa. They're off.
Simpson. Rising hard to the corner. Tries to make a stick to the outside. Makes it drive. Coming off the end of the board. Let's him. 200 at that. Duck to the outside of Eric Silva. Silva out of Warren, Rhode Island. At the line. Ready to go with Winston Bach.
Davis. Down to the bottom is Bradstreet. Coming off turn number four, Gil Bradstreet. Power to the finish, Gil Bradstreet wins it. And they're off down to the one. Brad Johnson with the advantage early. Off the corner they come, Brad Johnson's going to hold on and win it. Franz Wettinger up to the line against Andrew Joseph, loser goes home. Wettinger to the outside, Joseph down to the inside. The Trans Am in the Vega.
That's the rear bumper, Kenny Klein, rolling through three and four. Off the corner, they clump down, and turn number one, Kenny Klein, leads the way. Brad Johnson, Matt DeRosa, clear. Down the back of the three. Johnson, right in the rear bumper, Klein. DeRosa trails. up that door. Two laps to go. This time by for Kenny Klein. Can he hold off Brad Johnson and Matt DeRosa? Down the back into turn three. Brad Johnson drives it in hard. Right up on the rear bumper of Kenny Klein. White flag in the air. Down the back in the three, last ditch effort for Johnson. Off turn number four, checkered flag in the air. Danny Klein wins it. Vega on the bottom, Andrew Joseph has been Tremendous week in and week out when it comes to the Troy Duke National Spectator Drag. Slow start there. That is David Borelli. Now the guy put the block on Joseph. Joseph can't find a way around. Down to three and four. Joseph goes high. Off the corner he comes. Broadway to the line. Joseph takes it. Buchanan, the Grand Dam, out of Seacon. Down to the bottom of Colby. At the line, they're off. Down to one and two, give it to Danny. Stop Colby, closing in. Drop to the bottom, right on the rear bumper of Buchanan. To the outside, not going to be enough time. Kyle Buchanan takes it. Your attention please, Kaylee Wilson. Kaylee Wilson, please see the officer at the main gate. You left something behind. That's the line, that's car number 22 out of Boston. That's Austin Huffman. The BMW M3 and his opponent, Rob Gingrich in the 49.
against him. Steve Aubin, another man who's knocked off plenty of Goliath. When it comes to that, Hugh Cherokee up against another one in Ron Colby. Colby up to the outside. Aubin down to the bottom. They are off, and it's Aubin with the advantage early in the one. Colby, though, fights back on that outside. Down the back, Colby looks to pull up alongside him through the corner. Aubin tries to make a stick on the bottom. He drifts up a little bit side by side. Coming up, third number four. He rushes the line. Ross Colby. Battle against John Johnson. Johnson down to the bottom. Hoffman to the outside, they're off. Even he's down to the one, but coming up. Hoffman down the back in the turn number three. Hoffman tries to close. He's to the bottom. Austin Hoffman down to the bottom. Off turn number four. Is get it go. John Johnson. This is Two times track champion John Johnson is going to do battle against the Tesla. That is Chris Larson. That's a line. Larson. Larson is down to one and two. He has a little bit of Back then. Gotta wonder how much charge he has left in that thing. 
Maybe it's solar power. At the line, they're off. The model line in the Ford F2. Whoa, 
hang on, Steve. A big push off the corner. Can he hold on? He does not. And Perry takes down the win from Warren, Rhode Island. But I think the biggest question here is, do we know what happened to the Jeep? Transmission. Oh, man. And being up north, try to find a transmission for a two-wheel drive Jeep. <laughs> That's a Tom Kazuda, excuse me. Tom Kazuda. Tom Kazuda is down into turn number three. And that Audi S8 drifts off a little slope from the back. He comes off a four and Boyington. Finds himself in round number three. Royal Hardy for regular. RJ Teeves. And the 15. Drifts up way high, has to back off the throttle, and as they come off of turn four, it's the Varus cruising to the wind. Going to the outside of Hartling, at the line, ready to go. Green, and they're off. Even start down in a one. Three and four. Harlan sticks to the bottom. That could be enough on turn number four. It is Brian Harley. Moves on. The Rose to the outside of Harley. Chevy Camaro going up against the Toyota Cressida of Mitch Baldwin out of East Providence. One lap around, double elimination the first round, meaning even the losers get to go back in. There's the green down into turn one, and Tavares leading it into the corner as Baldwin. He got to play They come off the turn for Chad Tavares. Doesn't even have to push it. And that president having some fun. I don't blame him. Uh, the fastest car in the world for the first foot. That is a, uh, that's not me saying that. That was somebody else who told me that. And there's the green flag as they head down to turn one. Oliver is trying to get ready. Side by side, the Volkswagen kind of upsets the Camaro off of four. Here they come off the corner, and to the stripe is Alamera taking down the wheel of Volkswagen for side. By the way, 
anyway, happy birthday, Leia. So, Leia DeRoja is celebrating her ninth birthday today. There's a green, we're underway. And as they head down into turn number one, it is Johnson. Trying to get it down on the inside, moves off the corner, gathers it back in, but Johnson guarantees in the 2015 Corvette. Going up against Kenny Klein in the Chevy Camaro. Klein trying to get that car set up. And he's got some tough competition, but he's got the jump and the lead down at the turn. With the body roll on Klein's machine, Corvette roll on the top side. They come off the corner and it is... Ah, Austin Huffman in the 2008 BMW M3. He's on the inside. Colton Furtado on a Somerset in the 2010 Acura TST V6. And the Beamer out front. Take down the win. Subaru WRX going up against Al Doyle from Fort Plains, New York in the 1990 Eagle Talon. That's two New Yorkers and a Jersey. In. There's a green and we're underway and it is the Eagle Talon of Albert Doyle. Subaru back down to the inside, takes a peek down there, takes a look up top, drifts it way high in the corner, and Doyle takes down the win. Look at him high to hang on, it's a three and four. Slideway through the corner, Joel can't hang on, and Gardino takes down the win. From uh, midfield, going up against, hold on, I'll get that. Up the 
and Tom Kazunis from Hope Valley. Kazunis with a nose head start as they stage. There's the green, nice even start. And as they head down into one, Gardino looks for the attempt. your beard. You are just exuding some bow tie flavor. Well, he just got one. Oh. I'm going against the grain right now. The VI4 absolutely. Hey, guess what? You know, the appetizer at Gapplebee's. There was a uh, joke on that one. Put a NASA gap on that right there. Woo! Rick. And then Mike Vincent, Mike V, takes it to the house wow. in the VR4. I think VR stands for uh, Mike Vincent really four cars away from you. Yeah, that's a good one. 
Denny Dimitrova in the GT oh, Run. Wow. The Celicas were a ripper in, in absolute rally racing. We'll see how they handle the oval here. Car number four, don't have the name on this gentleman, but would be, you would assume, 89, but not the case. And then the uh, car 28, that's car 28, I believe. Going for the win! Coming out of top three! Coming in high! Oh, getting close again! Oh. What do we got? What do we got? So car number 29, Josh, and then car number nine, that is Kenneth Klein in the Mitsubishi Eclipse. Oh! Josh gets gassed! Megan Josh, take that little bit. It's a neighborhood place, though. Wow. Well, the Eclipse is getting out. Dude, the Eclipse is ripping. I feel like the guy in the Eclipse is buddies with the guy with the VR4. Camaro, <laughs> for sure. I have to go for the Camaro. S2000, but with the gap on. Look at Savage is going against the grain. CJ Fisher gets the jump in S2000, but there it goes. Carter with my two mini Garcia. Course Sergeant from Hilliard, Ohio, and then pilot of GTR, that is James Dipple. James gets the jump into GTR. Oh, okay. Oh, he's back in. Might be a little scared to take him to the wall. Dude, the Peter. Mustang is out handling him. Showboat? <laughs> oh, he's. Oh, God. He's got to get behind him. Cars. <laughs> oh, oh, let oh, it oh, rip. I don't know. Expensive in this in this whole grid. Oh, Chad's gonna take that low line, but the McLaren still gets him by half a car. Fleet is down here racing an ATSV. Yep. Pretty good race here off the line going into turn one. We got Cletus taking the low low. CTSV trying to take it high. See what's gonna happen here on the street. Cletus. It's Chad Ware in the Cadillac ATSV. Cletus taking the low line. Maybe he's gonna really punch it here. I don't think he's got it. ATS takes the win by a fender. But I'm still gonna stick with the American Muscle here. I got that GT350. There he goes. Speed. Ooh, coming in high. 
About four cars here. Let the dog eat. Here we go. Matt Winnington in that banged up Corvette, but Cletus said it. Those Corvettes, they are weapons. and the, the, the V version. Alec Carsons is up here. He's joined us. Is he a late entry? I think he's going to go out there and compete in Spark Theater Drag as well, right? SCI. Oh, you're with SCI. Yeah. Oh, this is, this is oh, absolutely Two car insane. lengths. Okay, so he's going for the showmanship. He dropped oh! Still might be able to get the win. The Cletus clinch. Ah, the VR4 still gets him by a fender. The CA's got that lower line. The GT350 definitely needs to get the jump here. Let's see what happens. No. No. Peace. It's over. Yeah, I'll take it, man. Got the W with the spin out. 